What's up YouTube, this is Prince today, TP101 and in this video I'm going to show you guys my top 5 tweaks that use the Touch ID. So this is my top 5 tweaks for Touch ID. So these will only work with the iPhone 5S. They will work with um, other devices but you have to use passcode instead of just your fingerprint. So my first one is called BioProtect. BioProtect is for $2.99 in the City Store and what this does is basically locks all any app and like settings um, functions so if I go to city you see there it's asking me to put in my fingerprint when I put in my fingerprint it opens up just like that so that's basically that's all it does guys so if I go to settings I could go to bioprotect to use my fingerprint to get in and I could enable it I could vibrate on error remember unlock session passcode option circle blah 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 whatever so this right here shows you all your um however you want it to look whenever it prompts you to use your fingerprint and then you could use touch ID that's when you go in and set up another finger and down here you get applications so you can lock any one of these applications right here all the ones that are toggled on are the ones that I have locked so we could lock any one of those so if you want to lock your messages this is a cool way to do it because I know a lot of people will be complaining that iPhone don't let you lock up your message so I got my folders. I could lock folders. I could lock settings pane. So I could lock any one of these, and just a whole bunch of. Even right here, I got my power off. So whenever I want to turn off my phone, I have to use my fingerprint to um, confirm that my phone is turned off. So if somebody steals your phone and try to turn it off, so you don't, you can't track it down. They can't turn it off because you need your fingerprint for it to turn off. You know what I mean, so that's the first one, guys. The first one is called BioProtect, and there's a lot more you could just go download it and go in there and mess around with it. But yeah, that's the first one, BioProtect. Okay, guys, my second one is called um, Bio Lockdown. Basically, the same as BioProtect, but this one is called Bio Lockdown from a different um, creator. And you can enable it, and this one you could set up your grace period for how fast you want it to ask you for your um, touch ID if you lock your phone I have mine set to immediately and your touch ID basically you just go in there and set up your fingerprint but I always just use the fingerprints that I have saved in the phone and right here you could select which app you want to lock switches so a flashlight LTE if I wanna set up all that in from from down here if I don't want those to work I could set them up from down here settings mode setting panes features you go through all these devices and like power off device same thing as in um bio lock lockdown or bio protect whatever the other one was so yeah so if i go to open up my camera i have to use my fingerprint so that's basically all this does guys these is basically just protect your phone using um fingerprint now you could also set this up to use passcode if you don't have iphone 5s so that's my second one and not much to go over because it's the same as the other one so that's my second one this one is called bio lockdown okay guys now my third one is called touchy and touchy is for um 1.99 in the city store and what this does it basically allows you to lock certain apps to your fingerprint so while my phone is open if i want to launch Cydia, i just rest my thumb on the touch id bar and it launched Cydia. and you could basically switch these up I got this one locked to my what, app store or my music one of them but let's see what loads up okay that's the Apple store and my thumb over here I have that one locked to my music so just like that so that's basically what touchy does guys you just add any app to your fingerprint and so instead of searching for the app you just place your thumb on the and it open up that specific app. So let's go to settings and see some of the settings. So scroll down to see touchy. There it is right there. You could enable it vibe on failure. So that makes it vibrate on failure. And basically right here, the fingerprint right here, I got one, I could switch it up. So I could add that to the, the calculator. I wanna switch that up. Could add this one to my camera. And then this one I'm gonna put my compass. So if I go down, well that didn't work. Try to vibrate. So that's what my camera. This one is what 
my calculator and my compass so that's touchy guys and that's my third one It's for $1.99 in the city of store check it out okay guys my fourth one is called bio launch and this one is for 99 cents in the city of store and what this does is basically lets you set a, one specific app to your fingerprint or the most used app to your fingerprint so if i wanna I have mine set up to youtube so if i you hear it vibrate i have to touch it with my fingerprint two times and then it will open up youtube so let's do that again you could hear it vibrate every time it confirms that it's the correct fingerprint and then YouTube opens up. So let's go to settings. Let's mess around with it a little bit. There it is right there. You can enable, enable it, disable it. You could set it up for automatically using your most used app right here. So if I have that on, it's basically my most used app. Whenever I want to launch my use it, I just use my fingerprint. And down here is, it has a confirm. So basically, whenever I try to open up YouTube, it would ask me if I want to um, open it up but I hit cancel right there but I turned that off because that's annoying and I have two touches two touches is good because sometimes you want to go home and you hit the home button then it will want to launch the app again or whatever but if you have it for two two touches so when I tap tap on it then it opens up so I, I could go right here and I could select my application let's switch it let's switch it to the app store let's go back out I don't want to set it up for that I have vibrate on success and that's a big that's about it so if I want to open up um, the app store one two and it opens up so that's all um bio launch does guys and it's for 99 cents in the city of store check it out okay guys so my final one is called virtual home so basically that's a virtual home button so I don't have to press my home button to do any home button action. So if I want to go to a multitask, all I have to do is just, just tap real quick on, on the um, home button. Don't press, just tap. And I could set it up for it's vibrating whenever it's confirmed. So I just, just like that, and it'll go to my um, multitask. And if I want to go to my Siri, all I have to do is tap and hold. I'm not pressing the home button at all. It's just using that touch sensor to confirm whatever I want to do and the cool thing is if I'm on my lock screen I don't have to wait my phone to open it up all I have to do is just rest my hand my thumb and it will open up usually you have to turn on your you basically press it your phone comes on then it opens up with this it's much faster and I guess it consumes less battery life but your screen is not coming on you just it just pops on for like a second and then opens up so let's go to settings and take a look at some of the settings so there it is right here virtual home I could go in there if I if this is toggled on it won't work that's to disable it so now it's on I have double tap for multitask I have tap on hold for action that could set it up for multitask Siri or do nothing when I tap on hold and disable it in the phone app so I got that off and right here it said vibrate on touch so whenever it confirms vibrate and quick i mean enable quick unlock that's the one when i don't have to wait my phone to unlock it so if my phone is locked just like that i demonstrate it again press my thumb on there open for a quick second then open then i hold that's for siri and i'm not pressing the home button because you could hear when i press it that's that's when i press it so if i don't want to press it takes it out of that just rest my thumb on it and it works just as good as the home button when I'm actually pressing it so there you go guys those are my top five touch ID tweaks I think they were bio protect um, bio lockdown bio launch touchy and virtual home tell me what you think about these um, tweaks guys tell me if you use it the one I personally use on a daily basis is bio um protect that's the one i use and that's my favorite one but tell me let me know what's your favorite one and if you actually use any of these and it's print today tp 101 rate comment and definitely subscribe all the tweets will be in the links below down there and also my twitter so follow me on twitter peace thanks for watching